Out of all the events you currently got in motion, though, which one you like look forward to the most? Um, I love my brunch. I think my brunch, um, my brunch is probably. I wake up every Sunday morning happy to go there. Right. And the reason I say that is because at the brunch, that's like the we have so many celebrations at brunch. Like, bro, it's crazy. Like, it, it's almost like the ideal place for people to celebrate. We got, mm -hmm. I'm talking about. It. Birthdays, goddamn anniversaries, graduations. Man, we done had well, we had two proposals at our brunch. We've been doing it for three years, but we've had two proposals. Like where people actually propose. And then one of the groups that uh one of the couples that proposed when we was at Brunch Kingdom, they just came back, I think that was uh October. They came with their bridal party as like they had got married and they came and did like a celebration. So it was like seeing those type of things, I think we provide such a, a good space for people to really like bask in like that moment or whatever, whether that, whatever that celebration is. Cause that's a big part of like how we get people. Like we get a lot of groups, you know what I'm saying? Right. Groups of eight, groups of 10, groups of 20. Like we just had a group um, like Sunday. Um, we had a birthday, a lady, it was her birthday. And it was also, um, they were celebrating Founders Day for, for the Deltas. It was 32. Yeah, thirty two of them in there. Like, so you don't really get that. Like, you don't go, to, you don't go to a nightclub and it'd be like, oh yeah, thirty two of us are coming to. Nah, I got a group of. You don't see nah, that. Yeah, it nah, might nah. be a group of four, five, six, whatever. But like the brunch atmosphere, I guess, is more structured where we we party, but it's all seated and all that good stuff. It's not like going to a party and trying to move around with thirty two people or right. whatever. But if you come here and you get these tables, y'all all together seated and it's a real celebration going on. So I really look forward to that because I feel like people have the best time there. And um people have shared some of their best moments with us. So I ain't gonna count the last brunch I went to was that brunch kingdom uh, yeah. with the big statue in front. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I got so drunk bro. That was us, yeah. I got so <laughs> yeah. I got so drunk I had to, I had to, I drove off. It was a rare lobster down the street. Yeah, I had to go park in the parking lot and go to sleep. Dog. It happened, boy. <laughs> it I, happened. I, yeah, I got so drunk at that brunch, Kingdom, bro. That, yeah, that shit. Yeah, man. If y'all ain't been, y'all gotta go to that brunch, man. I ain't been back since. May not yeah, because had, of that, but because my my uh, Sunday schedule be kind of crazy. Yeah, we had we had McConey now though. We had McConey. Um, had a ball located right next to Kings Bowling every Sunday, twelve to five. So 